here we will demonstrate the synchronization between the RPi and the Arduino. So let's first start the Arduino. And we see it started and it's now waiting for the RPi to finish personalization. In other words, it's waiting for the RPi to, to tell it that it can start searching for the head of a label. All right, so now we go back to our RPi over here and we start it. And it started, and now it's waiting for the taggy to get ready. So we go back to our taggy, and we see that taggy is advancing. And uh, it will reach the end of its advance. It's reached the end, and now it's waiting for the RPi to finish personalizing. And we can see the RPi is personalizing. And then we're going to see what happens. The RPi will now finish personalization, and it will be... RPi is ready for the taggy to advance, it's advancing, and the RPi is waiting for taggy to get ready, and on. We will go on and on and on forever and ever. Oh, it's ready, so now we can see the taggy is ready, and then personalizing has begun. And if we want to get a longer view of the whole thing, to see really what's going on in terms of synchronization, we see that tuck, it finishes, it starts moving, and the other one waits. So now we're, Arduino is advancing the band, the roll while the other one is waiting, while the, the personalizer is waiting. Up, oh, they reach the end of the movement. Taggy is now ready for personalization. It's personalizing while the tag while the taggy is waiting for the RPI to finish personalizing. Up, oh, the RPI finishes personalization. The taggy discovers that it's now advancing its band, its roll, and the RPI is waiting. See how that works? And if we stop, if we kill the uh, one or one process. Uh, we have to do this, sorry. We have to, if we kill this, what happens to the other one? Oh, well, then it just waits. It just waits because it will have no idea what's going on. It just, the, uh, the, and when killing itself, the, the personalizer will set itself to uh, waiting <coughs> to personalizing so that the RPI, so that the Arduino doesn't advance. There we have it. And we start it up again. It just works again magically. 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 It's unbelievable.